Well, it's one thing to get up at the crack of dawn to go fishing or hiking through the woods. It's something else to get up early on your day off so you can come out here to collect garbage. And yet people do this all over the state of Missouri, cleaning up streams, rivers, creeks, and floodplains. We're going to meet some of these dedicated people, find out just what they're doing and why they do it. But first, we're going to introduce you to a man who also picks up a brush and heads outside. The St. Louis region has so many treasures that many of us St. Louisans just aren't aware of until somebody from another city comes and tells us about them. Well, one of those treasures is artist Billy O. O'Donnell, who is nationally acclaimed for his talents at landscape painting, and in fact has been named by a number of museums as one of the top 50 landscape artists in America. And he lives on a mountaintop in Eureka, Missouri, in a log cabin. Over the past 25 years, William O'Donnell, who goes by the name of Billy O, has devoted his life to seeing, really seeing, the world around him and recreating it with paint on canvas. His specialty is plein air painting, which is painting on location, outdoors, in every kind of weather, to capture moments in time, how they look, but even more so, how they feel. It's about the moment in time where I'm at, who I am, and how it all comes through me. This is something that's happening. It's something that's here in, in this moment, and I want to capture that. I can always paint back in the studio. I can always paint from a photograph. But this moment in time, in my life, I'm here, my emotions are coming through me, and I'm capturing what's here in my life, and it becomes a diary almost of who I am, where I am, and what I'm doing. Sometimes what's passed through me and is on the canvas comes back and affects me and the way I see what's there. So it's, it, it plays both ways. Do you like the way this one's shaping up? It's starting to shape up, yeah. It's got a ways to go. It's, it's coming. This requires a very special language, not of words, but of colors, shadows, light, textures, and brush strokes. That's, that's the thing that excited me, was understanding what brush strokes are saying, what color is saying, how things are coming together, so that when I create something, I'm able, to, I'm able to capture that emotion that I am that day and that moment in time. Even though Billy O has painted all over the world, he has a special affection for the landscapes of Missouri. Born and raised in the country outside Warrenton, he's painted scenes from all 115 counties in Missouri. He's organized artists from across the state to paint the Katy Bicycle Trail. He has driven thousands of miles down the back roads of Missouri, stopping to paint the sun setting behind a hill, a morning mist rolling through a forest, or moonlight playing on snow. Oh gosh, there's so much here. There's, there's so much. Uh, and that's something I realize more and more the, more, the more I'm painting all the time. And I, I hear people talk about light in a lot of places, but this river valley is really special to me when it comes to light. I, I've, I've seen some incredible atmospheric things happen out along the Missouri River Valley and, and the Mississippi River Valley. So painting a symphony orchestra would seem somewhat of a stretch. But last year, Billy O created a series of paintings of the St. Louis Symphony Orchestra and donated the images to the symphony. Just as with the symphony that plays with a limited amount of time, and they're, they're only going to be there for so much time, all the things I learned, all the things that I've acquired over years of being out on location with the sunlight changing, with clouds coming in, those kinds of things, it all came into play with painting, this, painting indoors the same way, painting the symphony. The music is so powerful and so strong, it vibrates inside your body. It affected everything about me and the way that I work. It, it affected my mood, it affected my, my application of paint and the speed. When their rhythm would change, my rhythm changed. It, it had a direct effect to me and my work. When you watch this painting, can you hear the music? I, you know, it's interesting you say that. Yes, I can. I can, I can hear them. For Billy O. O'Donnell, his pursuit of the moment, capturing it in paint and making it reveal all that it holds physically and emotionally, 
has taken him to places most of us never go. Places that require a special kind of vision and patience. Sometimes it's, it's after waiting for a, a couple of hours or it's, it's, it's waiting for the sky to open up and the, and the sun comes out that all of a sudden this subject that you know there's something there you want, all of a sudden it's there and I got to respond to that moment. A lot of times you only have one chance to say something or one chance to do something and that's kind of how each of my paintings are. Either get it or you don't. Exactly right. That's, that's exactly right. Either get it or it's gone. And then you just move on to the next painting.